Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever Nip Strip Showdown, where we'll face off on what criteria makes the best spoke wrenches strip a nip. Who will be crowned the first ever winner? Stay tuned to watch this epic challenge unfold. What makes a spoke wrench most likely to strip a nip? To find out, I'll introduce and compare five different contenders that I've collected over time, which include Ice Tools, Bike Hand, Park Tool SW42, DT Swiss, and a generic multi slot. Each contender will be evaluated on the following criteria, including number of sides, shape, fit, grip slip, and leverage. Everybody ready? Let's meet our contenders. Contender 1 Generic multi slot. Number of sides is 3. Shape is rectangular. Fit is loose. Grip and slip is smooth and likely. Leverage is very good owing to the raised sides. Contender 2 DT Swiss. Number of sides is 4. Shape is diamond. Fit is very tight. Grip and slip is semi smooth and likely. Leverage is good owing to the large flat handle. Contender 3 Park Tool SW42. Number of sides is 3. Shape is rectangular with beveled nibs. Fit is semi loose. Grip and slip is smooth and likely. Leverage is very good owing to the medium sized curved handle. Contender 4 Bike Hand. Number of sides is 4. Shape is diamond. Fit is tight. Grip and slip is no slip and very unlikely. Leverage is very good owing to the large sized curved handle. Contender 5 Ice Tools. Number of sides is 4. Shape is diamond. Fit is tight. Grip and slip is no slip and very unlikely. Leverage is good owing to the small sized curved handle. Who's the overall winner? We can eliminate the following contenders, placing 5th to 3rd by Can. Ice Tools and DT Swiss. They all have tight fits on the nips owing to their four-sided diamond shapes. Bike Hand's larger non-slip handle makes a nip strip the least likely, earning it fifth place. Ice Tool's smaller non-slip handle makes a nip strip more likely, owing to less leverage, earning it fourth place. DT Swiss's semi-smooth flat handle makes a nip strip more likely, owing to less grip and easy slip, earning it third place. This leaves only two contenders to duke it out for first place, generic, multi-slot, and Park Tool SW42. Drum roll, please. And the winner is... Generic Multi-Slot. Its smooth, easy slip handle and loose-fitting rectangular three sides make a nip strip most likely, earning it first place of the first ever nip strip showdown. Let's not forget our runner-up, the Park Tool SW42. Its three-sided rectangular shape with beveled nibs and semi-slip grip make a nip strip more likely earning it a well-deserved second place. Thanks to everyone for tuning in to the end of the first ever Nip Strip Showdown. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before checking out the main event, Hobby Bike 51's DIY Chewing Stand versus the Park Tool TS 2.2 by clicking right here.